YouTube what is good it is Tuesday and boom we have a crazy batch of orders a lot of stuff you wouldn't expect to sell a lot of stuff you would expect to sell we got jerseys we got hats we got shorts we got shoes with no box we got shoes with no box very good condition we got shoes with no box probably brand new we got brand new retros going all across a couple used retros a couple used classics where do I begin I'm not gonna go into every single sneaker but I'm just gonna mention a few first off NBA Supremes going out that's awesome to see because we have a bunch of those and I know you guys hear this a lot, those never sell. But those actually really never sell. Obviously, the season's coming around the corner. People are trying to get freaky with those, and I feel them. Speaking about getting freaky with those, she, ball, don't lie, jersey right there. Vintage Nike Swingman, very nice to see that next to the authentic Jason Taylor joint. We sold that for under $100. I think that's a steal if you're a Dolphins fan. Speaking about a steal, got the TZ Reebok. Check the apps on those. They're going for under retail. I know it's different, but, you know, it is what it is. Speaking about different, we got the BYW Pharrell Chinese New Year that I bought in Florida and lost some money on. It happens, it is what it is. Check these right here, Air Max 95s, can't go wrong, very, very clean. Next to these Bo Jackson 91s, Bo Nose, Raiders edition. Uh, if you know, you know, this was definitely a time right here when these came out, shouts to whoever purchased these. We do it all here, man. If we think we can make a little bit of profit, we will buy it. Kansas City Chiefs, Air Trainer SC, something you never really see. Kobe's, TSK shirt, shouts to everyone who ordered TSK shirt, Patty LaBelle shirt, and uh, that's about it. For me, for the orders, let's let the guys talk about their favorites and all that it's tuesday tuesday you know it's like a 40 50 ball in here uh, like ace i'm not gonna go to every order but i just want to highlight a couple orders i think we just start off with the off white force again one of those shoes where it's kind of like dipped a lot in price right now but again it's nonetheless still a really really good shoe those supreme air forces the black i know a lot of people don't like black air forces they're crazy or they like people like you don't trust people with black air forces but back in the day you know, we had black air forces like they were fire so real quick real quick did you see who's wearing black air forces on the walk-in AJ, aj brown aj brown has been balling black air forces uh, again a lot of the young kids don't like black air forces which i get but back in the day like in the early 2000s black air forces were a really popular thing especially with all the different colorways you got a classic burgundy five going out classic uh, metallic red foam positive cool grades the raiders and the kansas city chiefs trainers are pretty fire tz's again one of those shoes that don't think any other store is really selling those one of those shoes where we see them out in the wild try to grab them for the store stuff like that because it's a really good shoe for us and we believe in shoes like that georgetown sixes don't need to say much about that my favorite air max of all time 2015 neon 95s a lot of great jerseys and hats going out shout out to everyone who purchased the tsk shirts because got some in and a lot of them has been going out already so if you guys want one please hit us up because they are going by pretty fast medium to double xl but yeah a lot of great orders great weekend college team one nfl team one so yeah back here with another big tuesday's orders and i'll start off with these pirate black v2s really clean black 350 sneaker you can't go wrong with that the union twos those are pretty nice the uh, yellow laces does help the uh, the gray and blue pop up a little more and then you can't go wrong with those off-white fours right there really really good shoe i don't have that one in the collection but those ones are really great great condition so shout out to that person who bought that and then those uh travis scott lows came in last week and out of the shows i think like last tuesday too so a week those things sold so pretty cool about that and then you got the classic fire red fives had that sneaker in the uh, collection but then just trying them on and see what outfits i could put on just really couldn't put them off so had to like let those things go but you know shout out to that person who bought those uh fire red fives really cool and those lightning fours man really good yellow sneaker the little sister has them she loves that sneaker yeah man can't go wrong with that and yeah also shout out to everybody who's been buying uh the top shelf kick tees man they've been flying off the shelves do have medium to a 2xl so cop one if you can because i'm pretty sure those aren't going to restock uh restock anymore yeah i want to start with these byws because it was such a great time in florida buying those with a so shout out to whoever bought those those tims those scream out apple picking pumpkin patch fall festival activities so whoever bought those definitely gonna break those in the apple orchard or whatever those trainers right next to them though are super fire i really like the red and yellow hit absolutely vintage looking absolutely gorgeous speedball trainers so jackson's air max 95s class sneakers right there and those kobe's i think that was my buys shout to the guy who brought those in i believe like i said previously in the video there's a cover that goes on top and a lot of people decide to cut it down so they could show the fly in it so that's a really cool sneaker to ball in tz's everyone's been saying fire sneaker and especially 
especially if you can get them for under retail very vintage classic 90s look nba air forces i believe today is opening day nuggets play the lakers and the warriors lay suns, suns. really good matchup and i'm glad that nba season is back so i can watch a couple games and shout out to everyone who's been buying the clothing love the variety here from football to basketball the shorts to the tsk shirts mixed with vintage sweaters it's just really awesome seeing like the amount of variety here it's not just jays it's not just new balance it's not just adidas it's everything so shout out to everyone who's been buying for this year <laughs> no nuggets <laughs> is that your final answer for today <laughs> Definitely want to say that again. It's an amazing batch of order. Shouts to everyone who's been ordering with us. I mean, without you guys, obviously we wouldn't be here. Shouts to everyone watching the content. We're going to work hard to get more content. I'm thinking about taking a drive to Cleveland to get some content this weekend. So we got a lot of stuff coming. Appreciate you guys so much. Uh, let's see what happens today. Jordan, you guys are not going to take the, uh, the Yeezys, right? That's uh, too oh, hard shit, to get rid that's of. That's a good point. The Chicago. Yeah, they're just too too hard for us. I just want to see the level um, and a half or level. I'm size. surprised because I got that on a draw. Yeah, wait, so I figured that half, maybe, maybe I will get today. But, and then they're too small. Off yeah, well, the, I didn't know. Well, the problem is just like no one's really wearing you Yeezys, and like the um, trend of Yeezys is just kind of like dead. Yeah, they mass produced them during the um the whole Yeezy Day thing. They yeah, wanted they to offload all, all that, yeah. and I don't think they're dropping it. Well, at least for 2023, I don't think they do any more so Yeezys. Have, you remember when I told you on these? So, yeah. 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 All right. yeah. And what's the what's the best way for you? Or ten and a half, just like how can you do it? I got I got Cash App, Chime. Yeah, Venmo, Apple Pay, PayPal. I, mean, I have I have an app uh iPhone, I don't know. I never did Apple Pay, so you don't have PayPal, Apple Pay? Oh my mm -hmm. wife has Zelle. I could I could Yeah, we can do Zelle. Yeah, right. yeah it'll, it'll go, go it'll go straight to her account. We I'll just need right the phone back. number. Yeah, I got you. Yep. Okay, what did you see? Um I saw the fourteens, the blue one. Okay. And How much you want here? Eighty. Mm -hmm. These views I'll probably pass on, just because of the size. Yeah. Uh, so I'll probably hold up on these. Um, I would take these if we added um, 75. If we like towards that, I got you. Should just add the paper. Uh, no, this one I got you at 50. If you added 75. Okay. You want to do that? You want to do that? Yeah. Okay. Cool. How do you like to pay? I like the 14s. Yeah, it's a good pair, especially the way they get like this. The quality is nice. They rarely put up like OG, kind of OG colors. Mm-hmm. You all set. All good? Yep. All right. Thank you. No problem. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> We'll probably come back here. Yeah, no worry. Yeah, yeah. Again, we have eBay too, so if you ever see anything online, you can always feel free to reach out to us as well too. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you. No problem, guys. Have a good one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Best stock. Best stock on lunch. Yeah. Okay. What are you asking? Uh, on these and uh. I got two. This one I'll hold off on just because it's a men's size, so the price is a little bit higher opposed to like the GS size. Mm -hmm. GS size is cheaper brand new. It just doesn't make sense for us to get that because realistically I feel like no one will buy it. Um, this one I'd definitely be interested in though, for sure. With this one I probably want to be like 150 for these. You can't do a book 80 on those? Nah, they're going for like 220. So that's how I got 150 and 240. Huh? 240. On style I just saw 220. Last, last pair minus 20. That's what I was looking at. Yeah. 
220, 220, 260, then 170, 230. 230, 232, 222. Huh? So 180. This is dope there. I was at 150. Alright, that's cool. No, it's okay. Yeah, no problem. Thank you, though. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> yeah, I just brought them. The home alone, I know we, we have one in the warehouse. That shit is a brick. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. So just leave it in there, I guess. Um, and then the Yeezy, I may be and this is like, is a decent colorway for us. What are you asking on the belugas? Uh, 2.30? Let's see where we're at. come back to. Market What about the reimagined? 250. 250. These 350. 350. These are two. Okay. And 220 on these. I don't know. Ooh, the car nose doesn't sound bad. <laughs> that don't sound bad. I feel like that's where the pain is. Let's see what that's. Can you do 240 here? Uh, yeah, I guess. See what we do on the rest. Okay. Definitely 350 on these. 350? Let me see. Are they up there? That's fine. Those are really nice, man. I just uh, it's 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 weird that they're so low. It's a good yeah. colorway. It's not too bright. It's subtle. It's a good pair right there. This one may have to be a little bit under too. Can we do like like 170 here? Mm. Can you do that? What's the best you can do here? Cause they're at they're at like two. Are they? I thought they went up a little bit. Nah, they went down. <laughs> the Honda's went down. We had 225 plus fees. Um, at 218, 216, 215. Plus the fees, right? So it's like two. Yeah, that's lowest ass. But the last sales are 218, 216, 215. You got one, 234, then 196, 2, 210, 220, um, 180. 190? Uh, let's come back to this one. Okay. Ra Razor Blue, you said 220, right? Yeah. I think they're, they're a little higher, I think. If I did 190 here, can you do 210 here? Yes, it evens out. Okay. So, so 290 plus the 210. We're at five there. We're at three, uh, 350. Here. You said what? 190? Yeah, 190 there. Plus the 210. Uh huh. Which gives you five plus the 350, which is 850. No, you at math is messed up. Wow. You're saying 190 mm -hmm. plus 210, right? Yeah. It's not 500. 400. Honest man, you're right. Right? I think I put 310, that's why. Right. You can give me 310 <laughs> if you want. I don't think your boss would be happy. 350. And that's uh, 350. So 750, we're at, yep. This one I said, can we do 240? Yeah, we did the 240. All right, 240 there. And then we're at 990, and then we're left here. You said 230. Um, call it a flat 12, make that 210. Yeah, my God. Want to do that? Hell yeah. Right. <laughs> um, you don't want my those fucking home alones? Nah, no home alones. No home alones. Right. What's uh? Yeah, the, Remo. Yeah, Remo, right? All right yeah, cool. I got you. These are hold off on the the off white back match up just don't move well for us. Mm -hmm. um, what you want for the Katrinas though? I don't know. You can offer anything. No price in mind. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Yeah. Anything. I just check, they go for like, I don't know, three something, so, I don't know. I don't remember. You can even offer like credit for this? That I'll just pass on, those don't, those don't move well. Uh, nothing in mind. Just out of two. 230. Alright, see, there you go, you got a number there. Something fair, you know. Yeah, I, I, don't wanna, I don't want to come in next for a crazy shit, you know. Uh, something fair. Two thirty. I think it's fair, right? Um, uh, two twenty-five. Two thirty credit. Two thirty credit. Yeah, look around, see if you see anything. All right. Uh, where's where's the sizes at? 
Uh, they're kind of like all over the place. What's, if you're a nine and a half, yeah. yo. Bought a good amount of shoes. There's two more shoes on a chair. That we just bought that I want to talk to you guys about, give you guys opinions. Got ESPN in the back. Again, shout out Berlin, the TV. Shout out to my cousin, my actual cousin. I know people say cousin, brother. Literally, blood cousin came by, dropped himself off. Got some stuff. 23s, Olympic, fives. That stock, size like 13. I feel like we always get this shoe at 13. Like, bro, am I bugging? No, we definitely do. <laughs> you always, always, and only get this shoe that stock in a 13. Fire red denim threes. Wrong Bob. But how you doing? Taking your alternate sevens. To Mirachis. Camel fives. We get these all the time. Forgot the name of these, but got these. Shout to this dude who traded for a reimagined three. Boom, that stock size nine and a half. We do also have a size nine online if anyone wants these. Another ten and a half, Kobe six all stars. A fire pair right here that I like. Kyrie, fours, day of the deads. Clean pair, military black, cardinal reds, racial blue threes, belugas. You don't really buy Yeezys, but this is a good colorway for us. It does move pretty decently. That's why I got them. Got them for a really good price too, so I'll make a little couple of dollars on that one. Shoot the air. You know we're buying these all the time. If you guys have pairs, please pull up, hit us up. You want to sell a pair? Reimagine three. Boom. Got some wizards. Supreme. SBs, I can't pronounce the name correctly. I think it's like the, the Ramels or something like that. Great artwork here. Really, really dope. We got some Cook Bucks. Boom, pretty trash, but probably like a 99 cent auction. We got some Palominos, and then the shoe that I want to talk about, most important shoe, well not the most important shoe, but most interesting shoe that I want to hear you guys take in the comments. How you guys feel about this shoe? Really like the box, the Nike swoosh, blue, nice blue right there. I'm doing all these reimagines now to the OG silhouettes, or colorways. Size 5, GS, um, Royals, Reimagine. I kind of like these, I'm not gonna lie. They're not as fuzzy as I thought they were gonna be. But again, these are pretty fire. Look really dope in a kid size. I don't like this black material though. Charles Scott's have the have this type of material on Phantoms too. So it's not the greatest material, but nonetheless, it is a fire shoe. Really, really like it. Size 5, if you guys want one. 4 on 4 right now, so got a lot of work to do. Got a lot of stuff to inventory. A lot of stuff to take pictures of, a lot of stuff to clean. Let's see what these next three hours hold. YouTube, I'm back. Wasn't around today, got a lot of stuff done. But we got two boxes here that I figured I might as well unbox with you guys because something different that I've never seen in person before so we're gonna see what we got both of these are from Supreme so I guess they're using this red and white tape now which is kind of cool so shouts to them I really don't even know what these are going for right now haven't checked but I was a fan of them and I hope they fit because usually I feel like sneakers like these fit a little tight and I went true to size so I'm not really sure I ended up getting two out of the three colorways I believe that came out can't keep track of what goes on but when I saw them I was like man they remind me of a shoe that we have on the eBay that I've tried on before but I know no, will fall apart if I wear them. So that's it. One, one sticker. Not even like the cool sticker. Another just regular sticker. All right, cool. We got the Nike Air Zoom Court Posit SP in black, black metallic silver, and metallic gold black. I always wear black sneakers. I grabbed the black pair, and I was like, man, let me double back and try to grab the green ones. These are wild, man. These are definitely something different for sure. That's a black pair. I have a good feeling that this green pair is gonna pop like crazy when we open it up. Yeah, these are wild, Ooh. man. Definitely that green goblin vibe right there. Something different. I believe these are both tennis sneakers. Keep that in mind for the look of them. Something really cool. I do play tennis on occasion, but that's not really why I wanted these. I wanted these just kind of to wear something different, something cool. I think they did a really good job. They feel very like posity as they should, obviously court posit. Looking at them right now, I think they're pretty nice. The green pair, I think it's really cool. And uh, I just think it's something they, they don't really make. We're gonna try them on right now just to see so you're gonna try on i've been on my black socks stuff lately i don't know what it is but uh wearing black socks just gives me a different type of energy in the day you know what i mean if your socks can't get dirty you know there's a lot less to worry about right <laughs> you feel me <laughs> all right they're definitely snug my pinky toe right here is just like super snugged out but either way i'm not gonna yeah these are these are very snug these are very snug i'll probably shoot for a 12 in these but it was cool getting some pairs for retail because you know as you can see i happened to rock the bb force today but uh little posit posit materials but yeah these are really cool man i think there's one more thing to, to unbox and then these guys could talk about these if they like this is not what i was expecting they had this uh playing cards but they're way they're way smaller than i thought like i didn't think they'd be this small holographic slice cards i probably won't open this i didn't realize they were that small but yeah anyways drop in the comments what you guys think about the court posits did they do them well what could they have done different are you a fan are you not a fan do you think they look super goofy but yeah that's my two cents jordan and armando and berwin can talk 
talk about them if they like. Yeah, that black pair, I don't know. Like like A said, like I'm really into black sneakers too, but all black is just like, I don't know. It doesn't look the greatest. This one, like it this pops though. Hard. This colorway is just crazy. Like this is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colorway right here, man. Like that green is just like, it's different. It pops. It definitely looks like a tennis shoe like on feet. It was cool to see Supreme trying, you know, a new and different thing. It's an experiment for sure. It's definitely an acquired taste. That green is crazy. From over here, it looks crazy. That green is cool, man. It's definitely it's like a green goblin. Green. Like the way it just changes color in the light, it's pretty fire, honestly. I didn't know these dropped already. This is sweet. Supreme stuff I can't even keep track of. I didn't know they dropped already. When did the the um the Darwin's drop? Is that dropping soon too? That's dropping soon, very soon. Yeah. <laughs> it's mad aggressive. But. The what drop? The, the Darwin's. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you are a common Comic Con yeah. goer and you like to dress up a lot and you're thinking about <laughs> dressing up like the Green Goblin from Spider Man, that's no a good tool, Halloween, like right there, you got it. This is the perfect shoe to combine it with your whole Green Goblin fit because this is what it's definitely giving me right now. I'm Who like, played him? William Dafoe? William Dafoe, yeah. yeah. Shout out to William Dafoe, best Green Goblin <laughs> actor he could, uh, they could possibly get, but yeah, man. Literally thinking <laughs> of his fucking laugh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally thinking of his laugh right now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's an interesting experimental shoe, man. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. The color, the color really pops on these, man. The material is pretty cool. I wear those. It's an interesting take from Supreme, man. You know, Supreme's always, <laughs> you, uh, it's always like goes out of the box and tries new and different things. You know, we always tell them like, oh, we want the retros, the star dunks or like retro cement dunks, you know, but yeah, they, ain't gonna, this. they ain't gonna <laughs> listen to us. They gonna come out with these, with this kind of funny. Stuff. I mean, I don't know when the last time they even made made a court posit they haven't made a shoe like this i'd assume since like the ninth like i don't even know maybe we should look that up i haven't seen a court posit released like in a long 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 time close up look on that one too I got a lot with some swishies. They YouTube, what is good? We are back and we have a nice size batch of orders. I think those are officially the what are those type of shoes right there. I mean, look at them. A shout out to whoever purchased them because they paid $33 ship. And I think they're, of course, going to Cali or something like that, just somewhere on the West Coast. But I appreciate you because, again, for $33, you can't really beat it. You put jeans on, I mean, come on. <laughs> those can fly. Speaking about fly, all the Yeezys can fly right now. We have a bunch of them, so I'm glad to see those go. That's a linen brand new. We got the Penny 3s next to the Michigan. This pair I got at a flea market. Shouts to you if you watched that video. It's a size 14, brand new. And it's funny because we got in a used pair the other day that Berwin put up. And just funny how that happens. We put something up and then the other one sells. Brand new UNC3. Check the prices on those. Shouts to whoever hit the buy it now button because we appreciate you. Shout out to Michael from Indiana for purchasing those beautiful up tempos. That's something you never see. Speaking about shout outs, I have to shout out Ricky from Georgia for purchasing the Flint 7 and the Bordeaux ones. Guys, the market is iffy right now. A lot of stuff is low. My loss is your gain. So if we're posting shoes for the low ski, you might as well take advantage. These were only $100 shipped. I mean, I know we paid more than that, honestly. So it is what it is. Speaking about stuff not really going for the high, metallic purples going out next to Fragment 3s. Very, very clean condition. This is one that definitely grew on me. I probably said that before, especially when you wear them out or just let them age. I feel like the back tab ages regardless. And that's about me for the orders. Let's see what everyone else thinks. These pennies, these pennies are fire. I've said it a lot and i said it the other day that i think penny has the best nike line from the 90s aside from jordan in my opinion i just think almost every shoe he put out was fire they're all bangers even when jordan came back he even wore a pair of pennies shout out to the person who bought the unc threes because like a said like that shoe goes for some a pretty penny right now still those fragment threes again shout out to that person as well because we've had someone come in here like multiple times and low balls on offers and you know folding a really really clean pair we had them up for a really good price in store and we stayed true to our price because it was a really good price these michigan they're really really fire i know like a lot of people say like once you get past 14s and stuff like that like jordan's become ugly or whatever these are really really fire even the um high version but i like the low version a little bit better it says go blue just a beautiful basketball sneaker every single pe they made that year of these so like north carolina marquette got them all fire all fire shoes and of course the Kyrie's really good basketball shoe um to ball in so shout out to the person who bought those because price drops so i've been <laughs> price dropping every night so the Kyrie's and, and those are definitely a test to that for sure put some jeans on you know quick look you know Hey bro, I paid thirty three dollars to my door. It's like, alright, well, I'm mad at you. A pair of J's, man. I mean, come on. And then shout out to the dude who bought the two pack of Flints and the Bordeaux. Really appreciate it. Yeah, we'll start off with those UNC threes because I love seeing those go used and new, especially new. Huff Dunks, if you want to get an elevated panda look, I would definitely recommend getting those. Fragment threes, like Jordan said, this guy's been coming in, throwing offers out and pump faking, but I'm finally glad those sold. They're going to a good home. And those up tempos beautiful sneaker glad those are going up because 
I believe. Um, we've had them since the last door. We just watched them sit on the shelf and I'm finally happy someone pulled the trigger on those. So hope you enjoy those, man. And that's about that. We're gonna pack up this stuff and see what happens today. I think I want them once. So I don't even know if I want them. Okay. Yeah, I want them. Why are you looking at that? I don't know. I feel like I should be at like 60 bucks on those. I want 90 on these and this. I don't know what you guys are paying on these, but these are brand new. Look, layoffs? Yeah. These two, what did you want for them? You so said 60 you? here, right? 60 on these, 90, and then, I don't know, like 230, 35 maybe? These are both the users of this new. Layoffs? Yeah. 230, 60, and what are you saying on these? 90 bucks. I walked them literally one time for like an hour or two. Oh, this one you said 30? Or this one you said 30? No, the 90, 60, oh, 90, 60 and 230 on these. This one I couldn't do 90 on just because that's what they're going for like brand new. This one, the 60 here is cool. Okay. Um, this one, can you run basically like boxes? They're going for like 230, 240. 225, whatever. Uh, 210 is box. I don't know if you got them in New York or New Jersey. Yeah, 228, I think. Oh, you got them in New York? Yeah. I'm yeah. 215. Uh, 215 is cool. All right, so 215, 60. 60. Yeah, these I'll just hold up on because they're going for like the 90. That's so what I'm wanna what do I got? 215, 60, that's 275. We're going to make it uh, another 50. Grab it. Grab it. I, I might I'm be so off, but it, we'll probably sell for around 50, 60. That's the problem. Mm -hmm. um, but I can do that. I can do the 275 here on these right. two. That's cool with you. That's cool. Um, what's the best way for you? Uh, you got PayPal or cash? Or uh, cash? PayPal we can do. All right, okay. um, you should have me in there already. I've been here many times. What's the email? I uh, did a quick buy. It's literally 12 or 5. We got here like, like a little bit before 12, but we opened the doors 15, 10 minutes early sometimes. Start off the bat. We got some playoff 13s, 10 and a half. You shot this year, right, Burrow? I think it was early this year. Yeah, so we got some playoff 13. This is one shoe that does pretty well for us. He threw these in at the end of the deal um, off camera. $35. Probably sell these for like 60 realistically. They're like 80 brand new. He didn't want to take them home. He just said, like, just, just take these, offer them anything. So we got that. And then a hot shoe right now. Doing pretty well. Playoff eights. Monday, I went down. I took a little drive down to South Jersey. Hit the mall. Was just looking around and saw a couple pairs just sitting on the shelves. A little surprising, but happy to, you know, get a couple pairs from the store. Cherry Drop this weekend. Berwin got his early. I know he said he really likes some body on that shoe is really good. So yeah, you got Cherry 12s. When you get them in hand, hit us up. We'll probably be buying them. They've been um, selling for us. They have been selling for us. We had two pairs. Both of those sold back to back on Saturday in store. Really happy about that. Yeah, that's it. That's how we start the day. Catch you guys shortly. So, so 135 for the four. Yeah, you got 11 yeah. you put it up last night. I'm gonna take. What this did you say you wanted to do here? 100. I I could do 120 here and I could do 50 there. But this, if you look, I mean, it, I know just because I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna wear this. Yeah, it's a crazy shirt. I, I mean, mean, it does have some pinholes on it. No, it does. I know, but like the ones that don't are like yeah. 250. You yeah. know what I mean? 635. We'll be at with everything. Would you say on this one 120? Yeah. 20. Yeah. And you would do 50 on this? Yeah. It does yeah. not with this yet. That's with everything. No, he, That's yeah. with the numbers he just said. Where'd you get this one, Aaron? Um, probably the flea. Yeah, those two with the flea. What, did you guys trade stuff in or? Nah, no. but we, I just seen some cool stuff on the eBay after come out. I haven't been here yet. Oh, you're buying all that stuff? To the new store. You're yeah, taking, taking all that stuff? Taking all that stuff. Oh, you said right. 635. I mean, if you want to do. If I did this for 120, can you can you do this for 40? Yeah, I'm cool with that. Okay. okay. I'm gonna take 25. Yeah, that works. We're at 625. That's everything, 625? How would you guys like to pay? Um, that snapback is fire. Zell is good, right guys? Mm hmm Zell is good. Anything you guys want to shout out? Shout out Milltown Streetwear. <laughs> Check us out on eBay at Milltown Streetwear. I would say, how much are you asking for these? 
Oh, it's a little tough. Um, so I paid ten seventy. Yeah, so this is what. I, so, so you don't have this one. Oh, no. uh, so <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I thought that's what they were. Okay, yeah. The one like, that you're I'm looking at, like a thousand. Yeah, I don't feel like, like I'm messing them up. Oh, is that actually original? Yeah, I just saw. Okay, no, yeah, yeah. Those are if I try those on. Maybe start credit wise of any. Any number? They're stable. Yeah, I see where you're at. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I right. probably start off as a man. Trade wise, did you see anything online? Uh, what size are these fragments? <laughs> <laughs> I think they're eight and a half though. Yeah. It's like, they run, it's they, just, they I hate, do run big. I hate when they're jumping on those, but they run so big. They, and they all fit differently. Exactly. From what I've noticed, yeah. they all fit differently. How much were you asking on these? I think we had him up for something crazy, like 15, 14. Mm -hmm. Let me see. These unions, what size are these union quarters? That's a nine, nine and a half and an 11. These are seven and a half, the too small. Um, the padders, I'm not the padders, the, the animals, I think like a nine, no, like 11. I mean, you can always run over to the next side, to the next side is all brand new. Mm -hmm. Let's see if there's anything in there mm -hmm. that you like. Mm -hmm. Credit or whatever, like it, it applies for both stores. Okay. Um, so you can always do that. You try them on. These? Yeah. Yeah. They, and they fit? They fit, but it's just like it's a little bit wiggle. I'm not gonna be honest, bro. But, okay. From like from from a person who've had trash before okay. that were okay. like a half size too big. Uh -huh. Like I've thrown okay. an extra insole in there, mm -hmm. but when when we're paying that much for some, or when you're paying that much for a shoe, yeah. you know, I personally think it's the exact size yeah, exactly. that I need. Yeah. You know, it's, it's not like a loss of found on white cement. We're like, I fuck, I throw in so like, yeah. that's like, you know, okay. you know, thousand some change right there. Yeah. Um, How about I'm like, oh, dude, let me let me see what I can do. Let me come up here when I'm free. I remember when I was a kid. My, uh, I didn't say you went to Stussy, right? Yeah. I'm um, I can give you seven give plus a hoodie. One this yeah. one, I want to give it to my son. Cause my me and my son <laughs> watch you guys all the time. You want to do eight plus a hoodie? Just cause they're stupid. I mean, that's why. I'm just like, and I think I, you guys sold one. I think one before for like I think what thirteen on even. But I guess what fees and everything takes out. So. And you said eight and a hoodie. Eight and then the hoodie. It's so like nine, pretty much. We at seven fifty in the hoodie. Me in the middle. I'm gonna flip a coin. Oh, I get to actually see one. see what is it? I will. I will say my record is piss poor on my own. And thing. my record is piss poor too. No, so no. It's like it's. <laughs> I literally bet. I literally what? I flipped the coin for for what? I think I for a five hundred dollar bet and I lost like that quick. So. I I, I you can ask Burr. I'm like I'm not even joking. Like I've been I've been getting killed. Like. The house has not been winning lately. Eight and seven fifty, basically. Eight and seven fifty. Yeah. So your number, my number, basically. I would say seven, but I really came up to the seven fifty. Um. All right. That's good. Oh man. <laughs> uh, here we go again. I'm paying back tonight. My family, so we will call now. We will call the air. I'll call it. I'll call in here. Alright. Tails. <laughs> Motherfucker, yo. Every time. Let's go. Every time. <laughs> slowly, slowly. Getting back to it, slowly, every time. slowly, I'm getting my record back. Every time. Jesus. <laughs> and the last time I lost, it was exactly heads. I'm like, oh, God, jeez. I'm about to pick it. Like, Tails has been kicking me. No, oh, really, nice. like seriously, like now I only did this what three times and I always pick tails <laughs> and out of those three times I'm 0 for 3. That's why I was just like fuck it. Let me just do tails again. And then look, great, great. Here we go. What's right. the uh, what's the phone number? What's going on guys? Everyone's having a good day. I know we are over here. Just bought some traps. Great deal for these. Size 8 used. And I want to shout out Carlos, a fellow Filipino out there. Him and his son watched the videos. I worked out a really good deal. Brought in these really great condition 990 V4s. You guys can see here. Size 8.5. You guys are looking for them? No box. But he took 
two t-shirts, Air Max Pluses in the blue classic colorway, and the TSK shirt. So again, Carlos, if you're watching this, shout out to you, man. He also ended up donating these Air Max infrareds and silver bullets. I believe these are both eight and a half. If you're a size eight and a half, these will be on the eBay page at topshelfkicks.com. And yeah, guys, currently 442. Low-key waiting on this guy to bring the CPFM fleas in because I'm trying to see what they look like in person. Catch you guys in the next clip. Hey, yo, man. What's going on, man? Nice to finally see you, man. It's from New York. Oh. Yeah, watching you guys on YouTube oh, all the thank time. You, man. Appreciate it. So this is the, the Lot 13 that you're taking in the house. I have the right shoes just over there wrapped up, but um, if that's one you wanted to take, I can definitely grab that for you. Now, how much How much you give me these for? Um, let me see what we have them up for. So the mirror's up for 375 Yeah, a lot of it's all price and though. I could do six here on these. These like around 550 75 Um, veneers. But you said we had them up for 375 right? Yeah, let me do which one. No, you're good. So the veneers I can do. I can do 350 on the veneers. Mm -hmm. um, and then six here for the lot 13 if you want to do that. It's basically the same thing on stock. Right, right, right. How much you have here? Uh, let me see. What did you want for this stuff? Well, I want to retail for the, the easiest ABS. Okay. I'm on a 60 for these. Is it just regular Nike joggers or is it like Snoopy? Nike? Oh, it's the tech. Tech. tech, tech. Oh, tech. Oh, tech. Yeah. Okay. Said, how much did I get retail? Yeah. Retail here and how much for the um for the lows? For the lows, uh I was thinking 110, 120, they like the use. I know I was looking at used pairs on um eBay. For like 160 still. And then which one did you want to get so I can see like I'm gonna take these for right now. So you wanna do the, you the wanna bananas do for right okay, now? Cool. Retail I wanna be do, be able to do here the tech fleece. I'll probably just hold off because I'm not really buying like pants okay. or anything like that. Okay. Um I would take these two, but these I would have to be really low because these are really low. Right. They're selling for like one 140, 150 brand new. Right. Um so I'd probably be around like, like 60 credit here. Um I'd probably be like 180 here, so that's two like 240, I believe that is. I'll probably be right here, and then I said 350 there. I can do so 110 is the difference. Mm. We just haven't really been buying Yeezys, and no, I understand, these specific I understand ones. bro. I understand. And you know what? I'll come back. Yeah, no I'll problem, bro. I appreciate you guys. Yeah, no problem, man. Graphic tees, where well, I can find those at. Uh, they'll be all across down here. Oh, right, so, like, right. this is just like all vintage hair, right? And there's like some supreme and stuff like that, like right there on that rack. Yeah, no problem, bro. YouTube, we're out of here. Great day. Shout out to everyone who pulled up. We sold so much stuff. Armando's in the back eating a nanner, and uh, we're gonna get out of here. YouTube, what is good? We are back. It is Thursday. We're filming a little bit today because I might not be here tomorrow and Saturday because I might take that trip to Sneaker Con. And I felt like we might as well talk about some of these cool orders real quick. Let's start off down here. We got the NBA row. That's what I call it at least because obviously NBA is back and, you know, basketball shoes are selling. We got the LeBron Terracotta Warriors. If you don't know about those, that's a very interesting colorway. This sneaker in particular, though, is not very comfortable. Even LeBron didn't wear them from what I remember because they weren't very comfortable, especially up here in the toe. It's like literally like a steel toe. Hear that? That's crazy. And then we got the Gumbo League KD6. This was definitely a time right here. These glow in the dark. Pretty good all-star pack for sure. The Kobe's I remember hit crazy. The high top joints, that's for sure. We got the Curry's Under Armors, brand new. If you know, you know. And we got the Gatorade All-Star PGs. This is one of those pairs that I bought and I just kind of put away for a little bit because I kind of figured they'd go up in value. That's exactly what they did. Definitely have to be patient with stuff like this, but it is what it is. I mean, check out the Gatorade Lightning Bolt right there. That's really cool. We got these Krusty Krab Adidas. Had no idea those even came out, but but uh, when they came in, I saw them and they're pretty cool and they're going out pretty quick. Two price drops I did right here. Obviously, I'm trying to price drop stuff every night, stuff that we've had for quite some time, stuff that I know has to go. Got the Sean Weatherspoon Adidas Super Earth joints. Sold those for like 50 or 60 shipped. Polka Dots, I think I sold those for like 50 shipped. Got a Detroit Tigers, New Era Old School, Yankees jacket, and some Jays up here. Let's not forget Crimson Tints, Blue Chills, which super rare nowadays. Fragments, used Jordan 3 denims. We got this newer 
newer release of the Jordan 13 that reminds me kind of of a Jason Kidd Nets PE colorway. If you think about it, how could I forget the Kobe's? These should definitely be in the NBA row because obviously the Kobe's are just, you know, you never see these, especially brand new. So shout out to whoever pulled the trigger. Got the fire Stanley Cup champions hat with the tags going out. Military fours, I'm a big fan of those. And uh, that's about it for the orders. Bro, and anything for the people about the orders real quick. Yeah, I really like how we've been selling a lot of basketball shoes lately, more than usual, especially when it comes to variety from like Nikes to Under Armour to LeBron's. It's just really dope to see. Jordans are really dope to see go out, especially those blue chills. Like Ace said, those are super rare. Like just some really dope fragments. And the Crimson Tints, remember I grabbed those on release day. Wiglet sneaker, if you don't want to spend $1,000 on that. Um, Art Basil. Art Basil pair, so really good alternative. Those Adidas, both of them really dope colorways, especially the Sean Witherspoon one. Really creative with that one. Polka Dot Air Max 90s, really dope colorway as well. Super glad to see those go out. And shout out to everyone buying the TSK shirts. You guys are awesome. Shout out to everyone buying the shirts. We have a lot to do today. We're switching things around in the store a little bit i have a lot of pictures to take content to make so we're gonna see what happens pack up all this stuff catch you guys next time thanks for the support Peace. youtube we're back and i hate to make this video but again you know bumps in the road things that happen things that have to be addressed as much as i love ebay we've been running into so many problems and the only reason i'm making this video in particular because i was gonna make this one but i was like nah you know forget it the reason i'm making this one is because they didn't pass a travis scott low as well same deal that you guys are gonna find out why in a second but uh it's just been extremely frustrating for us and not even getting into the money that we're losing forget about the money aspect it's just a reputation aspect and people thinking that we're possibly trying to sell fake shoes and clearly that's not the case here exhibit a we're going to talk about we have a just dawn 2 as you can see first off what's one thing you notice about the box it's huge there's no way this box is fake there's no way this sneaker is fake and if it was it clearly would include a lot of these things so first off we got the box we have a goat label we have our label and we have ebay's label when they sent it back and we go into the shoe first off before this is said this sneaker was purchased on goat i literally have the goat receipt i could send it to burn one to put right here and again they're 100 authentic the other issue i'm having is we have the just dawn pin in the box with the pair and of course when they come back the just dawn pin is gone but let me show you some other things that are included in this pair to just show you that obviously it's real first off we got the just dawn back i mean is that really gonna like just the the common knowledge of fakes versus real so like you know that's not gonna be fake and then we got the sneakers we also have some goat stuff. We have the Air Jordan keychain thing without the keychain. We have this that says the item didn't pass authentication. For this reason, you may not relist it on eBay as it is in violation of our counterfeit item policy. Reasons I'm having issues with that. If that really is the case, why can't eBay start providing reasoning for why they think that these sneakers aren't real, right? In this particular case, it seems that every time we send a very used sneaker in, nobody there is confident enough to make a judgment on them. So they're just not passing them. As you can see right here these have some issues with color damage and stuff like that again things that if this shoe was fake wouldn't happen fakes don't have these sort of issues like a real pair would right the way this is faded the way the leather hits the way the leather feels the way the tag looks everything about this sneaker is 100 authentic and that's not even talking about the box and stuff like that again i really love ebay you know it's sad i had to address this but it has to be addressed and the reason i'm addressing this is because i bet a lot of people obviously are doing business with people if you get an email from ebay that says oh your item didn't pass or whatever we're sending it back to the seller that doesn't mean the seller is selling fake stuff i'd assume a lot of people will assume that and that's tough for the sneaker community right there's not that many sneaker stores around anymore and for sneaker stores to be selling authentic merchandise and for ebay to be saying it's not real that's just tough with that being said there's been a lot of uh stuff going on with sneaker stores in general when it comes to consignment shops going ghost consignment shops stealing money writing bounce checks places just disappearing not not making it with that being said guys sneaker stores being in business it's not easy so in in your local town if you guys have a sneaker store or a skate shop and um they do good business just try to support them the best way that you can because this shit's not gonna last forever right sneaker stores and skate shops and all this stuff isn't gonna last forever that's why there's not a lot of them around anymore especially how it used to be so it's important to you know try to support the ones in your neighborhood man whether it's this neighborhood whether it's town over wherever it's at just try to support people doing good business because obviously there's a lot of people out there who don't do good business and that's not good right it gives the sneaker stores bad reputation so if there's a you know skate shop or a sneaker shop in your town or in your area try to support them the best you can even if sometimes you got to pay twenty dollars more fifty dollars more whatever it's good to support local businesses especially in your town because you don't know how long they'll be around i don't know how i got to that but it's just sad that uh ebay is doing that stuff whoever's working there needs more education you know nowadays it's always he said she said so if someone says that this person's selling fakes and this person isn't or whatever they're gonna believe whatever they hear and i've been doing this a long time and sometimes when we get these emails that says your item didn't pass it's like bro i'm not going crazy this shoe is real and uh we're gonna definitely 
test that by putting these on GOAT and trying to sell them really quick for a low ski price. And once they sell and get authenticated, we'll obviously include that in the video. And eBay, man, you guys gotta do better. Again, if you believe a sneaker is fake, just put why. That's all, that's all I'm asking. I don't believe this shoe is real because it has discoloration from age and I'm not comfortable passing it as authentic. Like if you wanna say that, that's totally cool and we can agree to disagree. But all these emails I'm getting that like your item didn't pass authentication because we don't believe it to be authentic and like all these cold words and bullshit basically it's annoying and we're not even talking about the money it's messing up right we're just talking about the possibility of it tarnishing not only our reputation but another store's reputation or seller's reputation which isn't good sad business going on i haven't put a sneaker on go in a very long time because we sell on ebay a lot but i'm gonna put these on go we're gonna sell them and we're gonna see what happens and whoever stole the pin from the shoes because again the pin was in there right you took pictures the pin was definitely in there that's just whack dude. So we, we got the shoe back without the pin. And of course the pin was authentic, just like the shoes. But anyways, let's see what else happens today. Two years. <laughs> yeah, he's next door. The next door is all brand new stuff. Everything in here is used. Oh, buh, buh, buh. How much are you asking for these? Um, I don't know, for the pine greens, I was looking for like 220. For the mochas, I was looking for like three. Mm-hmm. This one's pine greens. One they, they, yeah. These are the boxes, but they, I think they mix the match. Yeah, so. So you said you want three for the mochas. No. Royals, how much you say again? Um, I don't know how much you're trying for the Royals. And what you say for the pines? Because you said two numbers. I said mochas and I forgot which one. Like 300 and like 240 for these. Okay. Something close to like 250, please. I actually copped those here. Well, yeah. at the old store. <laughs> yeah, I saw the old tag. I was like, damn, it's been a while. So this stuff will probably hold off on for now. Right. Um, this other stuff, let me see where I'll be at number wise. Right. So I basically value. Um, Cash wise, everything five. Um, store credit will be definitely a little bit more. I'll just say, just let me see, just let me know what you see. Um, I can move numbers around. I'll bump this stuff up. I'll bump some stuff down from um, whatever you see. If you saw anything, All right, but where where would be at? We would like we do like four fifty for two of them. Nah, I don't even know. Um, because um, yeah, I was just trying to get like two hundred at least for each of them. I feel you. Um, so like basically the breakdown was. 150, 175, two. That's where that. Is. Okay. Realistically, with with these two, will sell will probably be like around the same thing, in like the 225 ish range. Um, this one probably will sell for like three. Okay. So what about if like uh, we do these two? Would you be uh, at like? Would like, you be closer to four? Uh, it'll be more like 325. I would be at. Mm. And what about store credit for these two? Okay, let me double check that. It was um 525. My fault. That's why. Okay. I'm at three. Okay. Um, and then how much you said you value these at? Um, these I value at one seventy five. These I value at one hundred and fifty. Okay. Would you do these for two hundred, like two ten? Um, if you're trading, like just let me know what you see. Cash wise, maybe. But just let me know if you see anything. Again, I'm I'm negotiable. I'll work around some numbers and stuff like that. Just let me know. Uh, but what if I call a pair of these and then we'd be at we'd be at two hundred? So you want those? Yeah, we'd be at two hundred. Um. You try them on and everything? No, they're definitely gonna be a little tight. <laughs> okay, try, try them on first so you have an idea of, of how they feel. Yeah. Kinda want you to get something in a, at home to just like match tight. I mean, yeah, yeah, I'll definitely look around. But um, yeah, these definitely gonna be tight. But with, uh, if I cop something, it could be at like 200 or 220? Yeah, like I said, look around. Like, again, I'll move numbers around so it makes sense for both of us. All right, but um, yeah, just let me know what you see. Everything's is um, tagged with the price, so um, if you just see anything, just let me know. You want to see the other one? Yeah. What size is that? Ten? Yeah. Oh, yeah. All tens. Uh, this is eleven. This one is uh, this one's ten and a half. Ten and a half. And this one is Citrus. Stay up here. 
machine. Credit or you're gonna pay those cash. Okay, cool. And how you like to pay? Uh, I'm gonna pay what Apple pay, bro. I see. So you just, just text right? the five sixty. That, that size like was like here. half size. Oh, yeah. bigger. Right, bad. Apple, like Apple size pay. I see. Mm -hmm. It was asking yeah, the same number. price. I got it. You know. guys for? You said five sixty. Uh, yeah, five sixty. You try to do um that plus one twenty for the pine greens? Uh. So you want to trade those two plus the world toes? You want to take, or you want to just trade? Nah, just the pine greens plus 120. Okay, um, let me find that box. That's a Ted, right? Yeah. So I don't think that one has a box. Check it out. This is another pair? No, it's the same one. I don't think this one has a box. Okay. It was supposed to say no box on it. Alright. All right, so what you trying to do on my phone? Uh, so like this, plus 120. We're just balled out, you know? No, no I feel you. <laughs> so that's like saying like 220 for these, basically. Yeah, like store credit, sort of. Um, I would do like, you don't want to throw these into the pot? Nah, because you're only trying to give me like 170. Yeah, but I said I was going to do more store credit. Nah, because I'm, nah, I wanted more cash here. Yeah. How much cash you want here? Like closer to like 250, 260 here. Yeah. It goes to the 250 here. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll do like two here. Yeah, no. 250 is kind of tough. Yeah, yeah. Um, here then, I'll do those plus plus 60. But then we'd be we'd be at last. You said 170 for these though earlier, no? No, no. I, I was at 170 here. I was at 150 here. Oh. Um, and I had said 325, and I said if you want to see something, like look around and see if you find anything. It's cool then. Cool. All right. You want to hold on to this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. All right, Or would you be able to meet at like 80? Like. These plus 80. Uh, what did I just said, 60? You mean a minute about 70? If I can keep my box. Nah. No? Nah. So I can give you a replacement box. It probably won't be a Jordan 1 box, but I can give you a replacement box if you want um, one. You can't meet me at 80? You can just do 80? Meet you at 70. Cause, Cause they have no box, you know? Nah, I feel you, but that's that's me coming up. Coming up. I just made a hell of bread today, you know. Nah, I, mean, I, I hear you. That's that's him though. That's him. But I brought him in. You feel no, me? I feel I you. Him in. Uh, but, but I'm coming down here, and, I, and I'm essentially coming up here. So, because these are at 100, so I'm basically dropping these a little bit more than okay. um, where they're at, basically. So I'm going under the 100 and then coming back up here for the money. So 80 is cool. 70. 75. You want to flip for it? Yeah. All right, bet. What's, your, what, what's the number you want to flip for? Let's do, let's do, let's do, let's do 90-70. You just went up another 10. Let's go 90-60. 90-60? 90-60. 90-65. Nah, 90 You went up 10, I go down 10. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? All right, cool, cool. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it. You want to call it now or you want to call it in the air? In the air, I'll show you it's a regular. All right, but. It's a double recorder. All right, but, but. All right. I got heads. You won. Ah. Uh, just so you saw it, right? I don't want to cheat. No, 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 I seen it. I seen it. Um, see, I think we got cash too. Good mm -hmm. cheat. Sure. Appreciate you, big dog. Sure. You want a replacement box? Yeah, yeah. If you go uh, up. Sure. Appreciate you, bro. Yes, sir. Appreciate you, bro. We'll be back. Be back. Oh, no problem, bro. Appreciate you, man. How's it going, guys? I know brand new they going for like six something in that size, but... I They're not new, those, right? No, I wore those twice, like, lightly. And you said you spoke to someone on, on Instagram? Yeah. And what they say to you? To bring them in because they don't make offers on new shoes online. Okay. And what you want for them? Some, maybe something better than three. I 
my boy was telling me, but he said he came here a couple weeks ago, but I guess that was the other side. Mm -hmm. Y'all got like more vintage stuff. And you said a little bit more than three, like, I mean, any exact number? All I told the guy on Instagram is that I would like four. I know I, I paid 365 for him. I didn't want to pay that. Fucking with StockX. How much you say you paid? 365. Mm. This was back in, in 2019. When y'all couldn't do 350. Probably be at the three. All right. You wanna do that? Yeah. Outside of that, nobody really knows what they I haven't seen them. Yeah. When I brought them, those those kids were like, what are those? Yeah. I've never seen them before. The problem is like a lot of the, the new sneakerheads, they stop at eleven. You know. High is fourteen probably. After I was gonna say, then you'll hear people say, I'll probably know. stop at 14. In my opinion, it starts to get good after 14, you know? 15s are fire, 16s, 17s, of course. I love the 19s, um, the 20s, I, I, like, it's a certain time, it's a certain era, so, you know. You grew up with it, it's different. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I get it. Probably the last buy of the day, just a little bit after six. Say kind of like a rare shoe, don't really see all the time. Kind of see it like every here and there at sneaker shows. The Jordan 17 Soulfly, size 11 and a half. A will probably keep these, I'm assuming. But pretty clean, thought they were new for a second, so I really looked at it, seeing that they were used. Yeah, this is a really fire pair. Jordan 17 is a beautiful model, really like it. With this like kind of sleeve, really, really dope shoe. It's a little bright, but again, definitely a fire shoe. You got the lace bag for each shoe that says so fly on the bottom really really fire definitely one to have in a collection if you're able to get I feel like the last time we saw them was at one of the sneaker shows it's a little bit after six so let's see what the rest of the night holds ready it is a quarter of seven wrapping up here so they got a lot of work done catch you guys tomorrow YouTube, what's going on? Today's Friday, October 27th. Happy birthday to my nephew. He turned six today, so really happy about that. Small batch of orders going out. Look like a 11 pack. We're missing one shoe, I believe. But we'll probably ship that out on Tuesday. Tiana Taylor's. A lot of people really like that shoe when they dropped. I wasn't really a big fan of them. It's kind of like the Zoom Comfort style, but with the leather inside. Really light shoe. I see the vision. Just not one of those shoes for me. Don't hate it, but I don't love it at the same time. This definitely has to go. I do like the yellow laces, though. I do feel like it brings um everything together with the, the red, the brown. You guys saw it earlier in the week. Someone came by, sold us these. Well, traded them for a reimagined three and these sold yesterday at the store. DB5s, got a little macaroni going on. Macaroni, macaroni. Got like the Bape Eyes right there. Nike check, a lot of colors going on. Got some Carmine's, another classic. Can never go wrong with these. This pair is a B grade because I believe, can you see on the camera? It's a pink. Yeah, so right here, it's pink. This shoe had a lot of problems when it dropped. I was one of the main things I saw a lot of people were talking about. Flint 13s, a classic, pretty cooked, but again, probably so far under 100. I want to shout this guy out because he did a trade with us. Shout out to George Lopez. He traded his Travis Scott um, satin gold, I believe they're called, for these. I think he kind of cashed something like that, but he got a dead stock pair of the Setch Bonds. Really good color. Two different shades of brown. The hit of purple brings it out. Really nice shoe right here. He got himself a good pair. We have some yurts. 574s. Pretty cool. Wild sneaker if you're ever lost while hiking or camping or whatever. You know, let's blow that whistle. Definitely not the best colorway. There are some decent colorways, but this one is a little too loud and funky. I do think this uh, neon green definitely kills it a little bit. Berman's probably gonna talk about these because, you know, big Acer guy he is. Um, funny, I love the John collections and a lot of this stuff is really expensive and it's speaking of Johns. Um, definitely a great pair. I want another one, but the prices are not friendly right now. Their stuff are pretty expensive, but I just like how subtle and calm their stuff are. I think it's just really cool. Something minimal, but very loud at the same time. So, A6 size 13 going out. I forgot the name of these, but I think I bought these at the sneaker show. Could be wrong, because I feel like we have a couple of these. But black, gum bottom, simple, skate shoe. You know, not too much to say about it. Just classic colorway. 72 and 10 lows. Infrared force, no box. Shout out to Darius from North Carolina. He got the T shirt plus the 11 low so really appreciate you and appreciate everyone who purchased something so i'm gonna swing it over to the guys see what they think about these orders hold on with those sets of buns shout out to uh, george lopez you did a good trade on these because these are one of my favorite dunk lows in a while i have this in the, in the collection i do wear these quite often a lot i love the purple swoosh right there and then we got the uh the salahis like i said i got the pink at home it's a really really wild sneaker but to me i think they're comfortable i like the uh the suede on the green here it's pretty cool the lime green definitely kind of kills it in my opinion but yellow 
still kind of like you know saves it from the entire sneaker and got the whistle in the back so and i can't confirm if this works because i kind of tried it out once <laughs> and i was like yo i'm gonna try this shit if i ever get lost can't go wrong with these uh, just platinum white a6 johns really really crazy sneaker first time seeing this in hand i just kind of crazy how these has a crazy um aftermarket price on these get the classic carmine sixes oh yeah i could definitely see the little bit of shade of pink right there and uh shout out to darius for copying that top shelf kicks along with the uh, jordan 11 lows i don't know if you guys saw but jordan and i are matching today unplanned i'll probably throw on a tsk shirt or whatever but now i don't know if we're gonna thug it out or not probably not thug it out we'll see i, I want to see if people actually notice so if anyone asks we're both filipino <laughs> <laughs> we look alike we look at the same fade we so do, we do you, you have more hair than i do but uh, shout out to JP. But anyways, here we are. Another batch of orders. Uh, I want to start with these jams. Everyone has a black pair out there, an eight and a half. Everyone knows I folded on it multiple times at shows. If anyone out there has an eight and a half, hook a brother up. The ASIC hype is just insane right now. Multiple colorways, multiple designs, multiple collaborations. It's absolutely crazy. Funny how we've been moving more trainers and basketball sneakers than usual. So it's really dope to see that variety of stuff is consistently going out. Speaking about variety, we got the yurts. Really like that colorway. Very loud. And I like loud colors. So really dope with what Soleil did on those. And the sunset buns and the dunks. Black gum bottoms, I believe. Um, really dope to see those go out. Dunks are at a really low market right now, especially like the regular ones. So if you're planning on copping like a dunk colorway like those, Pandas, USCs, um, UNCs, Michigans, anything like that right now, it's a perfect time to cop them. So if you've been looking for your favorite colorway in the dunks, definitely recommend getting those now. These Katrinas are Hall of Fames. Really love the quality on these. I mean, they look like exactly like a white cement three. So the tumbled leather from the cement to the red hat on the back is just beautiful and i end off with these pianas i actually kind of like these i like how they're a different jordan one they're like a different take does reminiscent of that zoom colorway and i really like the special box packaging i believe like all of tiana's uh, homies got them like dj khaled and a couple other people and they i got it in this like botanical glass like clear case which is really dope so and shout out to darius for the tsk shirts y'all have been killing it by getting the gta's and the top shelf kick shirt I believe we're not restocking on the gta shirts if you guys do want to get a gta shirt i believe we only have medium through 2x yeah. like two 2x's i think yeah said. so 30 shipped i believe 25 in store we also have hoodies it's hoodie season i believe those are 40 in store 50 shipped shout out to everyone out there who's been showing love on the youtube videos and the ebay store don't forget to shop at topshelfkicks.com let's see what friday holds that's a fact. Good? You sure? Yeah, I'm winning. Win. And then no just this one has that mark. I don't know if you saw that. It's good. All right. <laughs> All right. Give me the bad ones first. Can he, can he give you a price for any of his stuff yet? He said 900 cash or 950 credit. I can, so, show, you, I can show you um the thing. For your stuff or this? For this. Okay. Mm, let me show you. Um, what's it called again? I'm old. No, no, I believe you. DM. No, I believe you. So this is 950 credit right here for you then. Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool. Oh, okay. I, mm -hmm. I think I think I get it now. So, if you're paying cash, yes. it'll be nine hundred. But if you're trading stuff in, yes. mm -hmm. it'll be nine. nine. Okay, right, that makes sense. On, no, no, you're okay. You're okay. I'm trying to get under these companies. Okay. Really call fishing. Yeah, a lot of a lot of these dunks yeah, are under no. retail. Usually, some for retail too. Under More retail, payments, yeah. Sad to see that I'm not really going to I got these from Costa Gas. No, you're okay, that's me. Let's try and get like two and two. Two and two. Okay. okay. Probably a black cement. No, that's, that's uh, a. Uh, oh, Portfield? Mm -hmm. And then like the orange? Yeah. Probably like 260, somewhere around there. Alright, let me see where they're at. Mm -hmm. 
and you want 260 for the laser orange and what about the um, like 220 220 it's 260 220 okay cool let me see Tell me, tell me a whole number. I was, I was trying to get around thirteen fifty to fourteen for everything. Okay. Okay. Um, I was at ten fifty for everything. Which pairs you don't don't want? Like I'll take everything, honestly. Mm -hmm. Like I'll take everything. It's just like 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 we said before, just everything's just slow. Mm -hmm. Um, but I was at ten fifty for everything. Let me know what you're thinking. Which which pair you super low on? The dunks for sure. Yeah, the right. dunks probably is where I was at, like the lowest, just because they don't really sell for us. Mm -hmm. or they sell like retail, yeah. really. So, um, but tell me what you're thinking. Like I said, like you know, you're always fair. Okay, okay, hit the dunks out. Do we not? Like that'd be nine fifty then. Drop the dunks. Uh, what I say, ten fifty. Mm -hmm. uh, it'll be nine. I kind of value them like 50 a piece. Yeah. I'm gonna call it 11. That's fine. Does that make it better? All right, so. All right, fine. 11, yeah, yeah. Like cash on top. Oh, oh that's good. Yeah, I always take care of everything. I'll get you next time. <laughs> <laughs> so we owe you 150. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Um, how we usually pay you? PayPal. PayPal? All right. Mm -hmm. Shout out to my guy Steven, it's a little bit before 12. He had hit us up last week saying he was coming by. Put some stuff aside for him because he always comes through. He never pumps fake on anything that he asks us to do. So we really appreciate him. Um, always good business when he comes by. He traded a bunch of stuff in that we're gonna run through for some 2011 Bordeaux 7s, black denim Levi 4s, and a pair of 2012 Red 4s. Shout out to him, we really appreciate it. Comes from a you know pretty far distance, so appreciate him taking time out of his day to come by, shop with us, and secure another deal. Start off here laser orange threes dead stock condition 10 you know not the easiest shoe to sell but again definitely one you like to have you know in the store because it looks good on the wall definitely probably put this up in the other store another classic three you know chlorophyll threes don't really go for much but again it is a nice cool colorway combo i'm not a big fan of gray but i like the way they did it on this shoe this small hit of green really you know brings the shoe together the green's not overpowering it's a nice like like slack green a little bit of black so good shoe here probably the two best shoes in the batch Everything else is probably not the greatest, but again, if the deal makes sense and if we're, you know, in the same ballpark, we'll, we'll buy it. So, size 7. I know people's always asking for small sizes and easy, so got a size 7 flax right here. Another pair of sand topes. Brand new. The Yeezy Naturals or the Bez, depending on what app you're looking at. Vault Griffies from 2016. They like the baby blue, sky blue, gone fishing pair also have I can't tell if it's like green or black or like a like a wash black but we got this version of the um gone fishing as well can itself so. probably sell a couple of these dumps for retail most likely because they're not really paying for anything good deal to start off the day 12 o'clock now so gonna crack the door open see who comes by today hopefully you know today's a good day we make a lot of good sales trades buy stuff like that a won't be here so you guys won't probably won't see a I believe he's going to cleveland so if you guys are in cleveland or were in cleveland I'll say what's up to a because he will be at sneaker con not much else to say about the inventory all this stuff so we get it up in the light box flicked up on ebay and hopefully one of you guys out there will buy them so stay tuned Catch you guys shortly. Damn. I ain't seen them shit since I was a shorty. You ain't tell Corey was coming, bro? Nah, I was on the move. On the move. Nah, they, I heard. Brand from, new. From my, from my experience, from what I've seen, I heard they went a whole size big. Yeah, just let us, just let us know. Or just let me know, whoever. If you want. The Pharrell in the made that. Ice cream? Yeah, that's good fashion. What you want? Package deal. Oh, these bitches brand new. I ain't even try them on. I wore these shits one time. This shit been sitting in the closet for like six years. Oh, package deal. Bring it down. I'm a fair pimp. 19200. Oh, 19200. Okay, I think you said Nah, I Shit what you want for just the shoes? Mm, you my cousin. It's a holiday week. These bitches <laughs> brand new. You said it's a holiday weekend? Uh, Halloween. Uh, <laughs> Halloween is gonna be, be outside. Halloween is here. Halloween's like on the tooth. Uh, hey, look, you look, know look, what the hell I mean. Look, yeah, look, look, you agree look, with look. Mm -hmm. it, It's just an excuse for him to drink, though. <laughs> Let him get him started. I mean, like, they both low. I know. <laughs> 
what we charge you here? Like two? <laughs> yeah, that hit me for like two. Maybe a little over, but it was like two syrup. <laughs> what did Chipotle order this? I, I, I'm gonna highly judge you. They took away the pasta chicken. I'm mad at them. They did something. That's, that's that good. shit was excellent. But I, I, I go um. The white rice bang, mm -hmm. a little splack out of beans, not mm -hmm. too much. <laughs> Which beans? The black joints. Okay. Double up on the chicken. I need mine's right. Okay. I mean, some cheese, sour cream, a little lettuce on that joint. Uh huh. And we gotta go guac with a little bit of corn. Respect, mm. bro. Come on, baby, give me I, some love. I, I, I have the same order, but with steak. Steak, that shit don't be right from there. Nah, I you bugs. I'm gonna be fair. I just wanna get these shits. Give me like 160 for both. Cause that is kind of, come on, come on, Jay. Let's be fair now. <laughs> let's be fair now. Let's be fair now, Jay. Dog. Don't do that. Let's be fair now. I'm gonna, uh, no, these ain't brand new. You know what they going for? Yeah, no. Like 90. <laughs> no, I don't know what's on 90. Yeah, you don't like my price. I can't help you on this one. This one. What would you do for these? Like, well, just give me. I would rather those than those because those are brand new. I mean, they both, I value both at the same price, really. What, like 50, 60 a piece, some shit like that? I got a hundred for both. I knew it. <laughs> you, ain't, you ain't know nothing. Yeah, yeah. You ain't know nothing. Give me 50 for you. Give me 50 for those. Do 50 for those too. Yeah. I can get a little more for these. These bitches are nice. Alright. Come on. The lapis and the zoolies. I don't got those, right? Nah. That's the one I want. I got the brown ones. The other one. First one. What are you asking with these two? I don't know if these were probably low on. But what's the low on these? What do you think? Realistically, yeah. Like, but then I bought these like twice. They just don't sell. Yeah, I know. Thank Brand you. new is like two thirty, I think, something like that. Two twenty, two ten. Probably a hundred. It's not bad. That was right here. What those go for? I haven't even checked. It's been a while since I've seen these. Yeah, I haven't, seen. I haven't pulled that those shoes on in so long. Those move for y'all though. Oh, these. I know these come. These we haven't had in a while, honestly. Yeah. It's my first time seeing these. For a couple months now. Um, probably think like two for both. Probably what I'm thinking. Can you go a little higher? Like what? 225. That's cool. Uh, Zell? Hold on, wait. 225 cash. Let me see. Let me look at one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely. 225 cash, more store credit. Yeah, yeah. Um, together, separate. Together. Okay. This one. This one I'll pass on. These three I'll probably pass on. The salts and the granites. How much you looking for these three? Well, these I'm trying to get at least four. And I don't know, what do you think for those three? Mm, probably just ask retail for them. Retail for one, two? Yeah, yeah. Can we do retail on those? Uh, I'll have to check. Let me see. Thousands, you said four. Wouldn't it be able to do four? Because at four, I could probably do. A 350 here. I was at 725 for these three. That's where I was at. So it was 175 to 350 there. That's what I came up. Can you do 120 on each of these? You don't know? Yeah. That's fine here. Oh, are these two the same, right? You Which two, ones? You have two granites? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah. So, so it's like. That's yeah. fine. Alright, so that's. Well, actually, the dark side, I think, are 229, I think. That's all. Mm hmm. Uh, you go a little bit higher, like 140. So I'll be at 11.5. Okay. Alright, I'll just take Yeah, you should take that. Yeah, it's cool. You should take that. Um, Zell, so probably this way? Zell, so, yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> you was quiet when you went five straight. You was quiet. I wasn't quiet. You was quiet. You ain't say nothing. Hey man, win and lose. I'ma talk like, my. Yo, they looking good. I'ma talk. Smoke Dallas, you was like. I'ma I'm talk my mess regardless. But Justin Fields ain't it. It, it don't matter right now. We still mean, winning. Y'all gonna get Shador or y'all gonna get Kaleb? Shador staying. Kaleb ain't it either. Shador staying. 
collab ain't it either. I'm telling you, Shador staying. But collab Williams ain't it. Don't worry. Super Bowl next year. We bound. Oh, I can't get it. <laughs> Cadillac. It's brand new. It's brand new. Cadillac. It's brand new. What did we what did we talk about? <laughs> what did we talk uh, about listen, last year? I need the money. We ain't talking about these. We no, no, no. Talk about bringing in. That's some good shit right there. No, it's not. There it is. That's how it's made. No, no, no adult is wearing this. It's simple, man. Look, look, look. With Mickey Mouse? Yeah. I gotta, I gotta hold off on these. No, oh, man. Check, check out the price. You, you get good, good money. What do you want for these two? One on top. For both of them? Yeah. These are Gasparillas, right? Yeah. I only want three for these. These go for six and seven. You look, I'm telling you, look them up. I can't. I buy just those. don't feel like selling them on eBay myself. Go get your money back. No, man. Go get your money back. No, I'm losing money. You remember what we charged you for those? Uh, for the, oh yeah, I charged me like three fifty. <laughs> no, I didn't even use them. Yeah, I'm serious. No way. I'm serious. No you think way. I'm? You think I'm lying? I didn't say you was lying. No, I said, I'm no way. Hmm. Yes, we did. <laughs> See, I told you. <laughs> yes, we did. Back in back in April. Unless you want to, you know, you want to give me that that three fifty back on them. How much you say you wanted for these two again? I should go what now? <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> I did say five. Five. I was thinking like four twenty five. Stop it. Come on, man. Give it to five, man. Stop it. Stop it. I don't want these, bro. They don't move. No, man. Take them. <laughs> I don't. Take them. Don't want them. They, they're moving my size. Yeah, they already moved when you bought them. Tom tom <laughs> tom <laughs> tomorrow they'll move. No, they won't. 475. 430. No. 435. 450. Stop it. You want to flip a coin? No, I want 450. 600 or zero. Oh well, yeah, right. <laughs> come on, man, four fifty. That's it. Uh, but come on, look at this. I'm serious. I don't, I don't want look, them. no, really, look at them up. No, for real. Like I'm serious. I'm serious too. I don't want those. Look them up. I can't do nothing with those, man. No, you, you I'm telling you, you, when you put the price that that Damn. you're gonna put it at, it's gonna be a low price that you put it at. They, somebody gonna love it. Me paying three hundred is not is not a low price. No, it is. Look at look them up. Tell you. Let me see a PayPal because I don't know why it's not popping up. I can't. What's going on, guys? It's six oh nine. Guy from last week came in, dropped eight eighty. Really dope guy. Got some really dope stuff, and hopefully he enjoys that stuff. We just had the air movie on, so the air movie kind of correlates to the shoe. You bought an airship? No, no, no. <laughs> didn't buy Chicago. No, I talked about it already. But anyways, I have an unboxing here. How about when did you talk about it? Like last week. I showed it to you on the phone. No, you you're, like, you're not getting those. <laughs> I didn't know where it was. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Shout out to no. Oh. Shout out to eBay. Dun, 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 oh! Oh! Okay. 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 I know it is. So as you guys can see, Jordan One. Some Maserati in there. It's a size eight. <laughs> it's a Porsche. <laughs> Boom. Zendaya. The black. <laughs> yep. I had to. I've officially completed the red Chicago black toe. Let me take these off. And that's when I took it personal. <laughs> yeah. Go so from a 2015 oh. Chicago to a 2016 black toe. <laughs> yeah. Crazy. But yeah, guys, it's officially completed. Shout out to the guy who sold me these because, like, it was a really good price. And the only reason he said that was because he needed car parts. I hope your car is okay. All the stars? Um, yeah. Super, super clean. Even come with the red laces and the flight club tag. Are you keeping it black here or you put white? Probably white because these already have black. But I don't know. Let's see how I'm feeling. A lot to choose from. <laughs> a lot to choose from. That's crazy. But yeah, guys. I don't know what to do next. That bull's fever in there. Yeah. yeah. Bro was about to have a heart attack. He was like, yo, where the, <laughs> yeah. like, yo, where the post I, guy at? I was like, <laughs> man, I was like, yeah, he in that bag. Bro, bro like, where? Where? <laughs> 
While you were eating lunch and Mondo was in the back, no one was here. I kept going in and out to find like. I was wondering why. I was like, why? <laughs> I was like, they said it got delivered, but it's not here. I gotta go. I was about to go to store to store just to see if someone got it. Yeah, luckily the guys had it. And it was in the back. And it's funny because Mondo was like, oh yeah, there's a box here. And I was like, what? <laughs> and he was like, and he was like, yeah. So I'm glad these came here safely and sound. Cashy's in the next fit. That Kobe shirt behind you, so Berwin. Oh, what it's up for? Yep, eight twenty four in the back. Boom. RP baby goat. Tomorrow's Saturday. Super excited about that because it's been a long week. Got a lot of stuff done this week. Made a lot of sales. Did a lot of buys. A lot of buys. A lot of shoes that we're kind of trying to find spots for because we're low key running out of space back here already. We may have to get another rack. I'm gonna have to ask Gay about that. About getting another rack. Put new shoes on. But yeah, so far, week was good. And hopefully, tomorrow we end the week on a high note. Get a lot of good sales. See a lot of good people. Shout out to everyone who's, who came by. Uh, shout out to the dude who spent $900 today. Shout out to the father and son we spent some money who possibly coming back tomorrow everyone came by to just at least check out the store and see what's up we're almost a month here at this location so time is really moving by pretty fast but it's been a great month for us it feels good to be back back on the block but yeah that's enough for me i don't really got much else to say overall it was a good week good day